I'm Elizabeth Vaughn from Custom Strength, and I'm going to show you a dead bug variation we like to use. Um, so you're going to start in dead bug position. Most important thing, keep your back flat, hands above your shoulders, knees above your hips. And what you're going to do is you're going to do one, press your hand into your knee as you press your knee into your hand, and then at the same time you're going to extend opposite arm and leg into the dead bug position. So then up here you're basically relaxed. You should be inhaling up here and then exhale. And then you're just going to do reps like that. Uh, and the reason we like that, A, it makes it a lot harder, but B, it just helps to reinforce that you really need to engage the core to stabilize your torso for this movement. Whereas sometimes people can adjust from a dead bug, particularly if someone says they don't find a dead bug very hard, it may be that they're doing this, which now says they've got this big giant arch here. So they're not actually stabilizing the core. Yeah, it's really easy to move your arm and leg. But if you stay nice and tight in there, keep that position uh, stable, then it is actually challenging. And then, yeah, extra challenge, but I add the hand to knee.